it's gonna be a one hell of a fucking fight. It's gonna be some crazy shit going down. Both of us are gonna be. Yeah, I go out there, guns high ho. I'm not gonna try to, to, to play a chess match. I'm going in the fight. Oh, however, however, whatever it goes. If he wants to wrestle, we can wrestle. If he wants to box, we can box. Stand up punching. Nobody wants to play with me. I want to knock out. I know he's got power. I'm gonna respect his punches, but that's about it. It's almost like a drug. To me, I don't do no other drugs, but that, that's my drug. The adrenaline you get off the crowd. The feel of another guy's punch. Sometimes you just want to feel what the guy has. And it becomes a more fucking crazy fight. And just head to head. Coming through the white to fight me. I love to see it. Always dream of it. I'm not afraid of you. You're not afraid of me. You got big gonads. You come to I'll fight. I'll be saying prayers for you. And just, I'll have your... Your well-being in my we heart. We met last time at a great time. You know what, though? This is going to be more fun. We're getting banging with each other. We're going to party after you. I'm going to spread you all over that, that canvas. Like toast. They're going to see a good fight. Man. Ladies and gentlemen, now, it's time for the main event of the evening. This is a special Rumble on the Rock, special rules super fight. Consisting of no submissions. If this bout goes to the ground, they are only allowed 15 seconds on the ground. This fight will consist of three five minute rounds. Introducing first, the fighter standing in the blue corner. This man is a boxer and a jiu-jitsu fighter. He holds a professional mixed martial arts record of 16 wins with eight losses. Standing six feet, two inches tall, he weighed in at 261 pounds. Fighting out of Hilo, Hawaii, a veteran of the UFC, Wesley Pepper! Now introducing his opponent, standing in the red corner. This man is a boxer who holds a professional record of 71 wins with seven losses. He stands five feet, 11 inches tall and weighed in at 394 and one half pounds. Fighting out of Jasper, Alabama, the IBA and the NBAC champion, Butter Wow. How about that? Wow. I didn't think uh, Kevin yeah. in Hawaii would be uh, no, <laughs> not at all. underdog on the crowd favor side. No. You break and get right to your feet immediately. Any questions, blue corner? Any questions, red corner? Touch gloves, get ready to come out fighting. Larry Landless brings them together, gives them final wow. instructions. So here we go, Butterbean and Cabbage. The two big boys ready to bang. What's the fight? Event. Now here's the rules. If the fight goes to the ground, there's a 15 second time limit, which means at the end of 15 seconds, the referee will stand them up. So this is gonna be interesting to see where this fight goes. Butterbean and Cabbage, look out, a lot of power. A high kick by Cabbage misses. Butterbean starts to try to tee off. Nice leg kick by Cabbage. This is what he needs to do. Stick and move like a boxer. Land some leg I, kicks. I have no problems with the leg kicks. I'm just a little nervous with the overhand right. That's all I'm worried about. Absolutely. Butterbean got so much power. He's known as the king of the four rounders. Remember. Look at his wait, face. He's just, he's so intense. He absolutely. And, and the one thing that's interesting, Rico, is bottom line with Butterbean, those are small four ounce that's gloves. I was going to say the exact same thing. I mean, a lot of power. He generates so much power with the big boxing gloves. Those are small four ounces. A lot of power. Did in you those not hands. see Butterbean knock out Johnny Knoxville? <laughs> Cabbage yeah. is, is, you know, is the man. I just, I want to see him protect himself. That's yeah. all. Dying him up, that's what he has to do against the fence. But Butterbean lands some knees too, how about that? Cabbage would love to get this fight to the ground, now he's trying to... Oh! He's got ground, he's got 50 chance, he's blinded up Butterbean. He's got to get, he's got to finish him. He's trying to finish the 
this fight. Elbow lands, another elbow lands. Butterbean trying to, Cabbage is trying to hit him with everything he's got. Now he's got to stand him up. That's the end of the 15 seconds. Cabbage is hurt. Cabbage is wincing in pain. Something happened to Cabbage. Oh, man. He's still coming, though. Oh, Butterbean tries to land a big right. Misses. Wild action here. They're just swinging for the fences. Butterbean looks a little messed up, though. Yeah, leg kick lands. Oh, Butterbean smiling at him. Yeah, Butterbean's smiling him. back. Cabbage would love to get this fight back to the ground, but... I'm not... I, I thought Butterbean would throw a little more. Nice leg kick lands by Cabbage. That's what Cabbage has got to do. Stick and move. Cabbage, though, was wincing in a lot of pain when they stood up. I'm not sure what happened. There's another one of the leg knees, kick. maybe. Uh, Could have been a knee. Not sure. I, I mean, Cabbage is doing really well. I, I like the way he's keeping his distance. It scares me the way he boxes with that left down, but he's doing very well. Oh, look at that elbow land right. Everyone's just like, oh, ah, there's a nice kick. Oh, right hand land by Butterbean. Oh, Cabbage beautiful knee. Cabbage beautiful with knee. Some knees. Cabbage. Butterbean with some right hands. Frantic Cab pace in this first round. I think Cabbage is doing very well. Very good game plan. You know, it, it, you know, he's getting hurt a little bit, but he's doing he's doing smart things. Absolutely. I mean, how can it, this base Rico? These guys are just giving it their all right now. Cabbage against the fence. This is a heavyweight bout. This is all the heavyweight. All 394 pounds of butter being against 261. Cabbage Correa. And I was scared a little bit. Nice oh, knee beautiful. By Cabbage knee to the belly, but I don't even know if that even hurt. Oh, oh elbow. Nice elbow. Beautiful elbow landed. By flush. Cabbage. It was flush. And uh, Butterbean right now lost a tooth. Butterbean just lost a tooth. No, he did not. And then put his mouthpiece back in. It looked like he spit out a tooth. Right now, Cabbage trying to get inside. I don't know if Butterbean spit out a tooth or what, but he pulled out his mouthpiece and spit out something. I, I think it was teeth. <laughs> Rico standing up watching this. Oh, Cabbage working the body now. Cabbage. Oh, Cabbage landed. Oh, Butterbean lands a left right combination. Cabbage landed a nice elbow, but I'm still looking for the tooth on the ground. Oh, man, both these guys slugging it out. Oh, Cabbage is hurt by a right hand. Cabbage gets nailed with a right hand. Cabbage now clinching. Looks nice like a, knee. I don't know if it's a cut above the, the nose or, or what's. Oh, man, I tell you what, this is every bit of a slugfest that we thought it might be. Now Cabbage backs. Butterbean into the cage. It is definitely an exciting fight. Oh man! I mean, you know, Cabbage is doing the smart thing. He's getting, he's making him tired by, like, by, by doing a little bit of Greco-Roman wrestling up yeah. top and, and throwing in the elbow oh, over the top. Left, uh, uh, the dirty boxing off the clinch. Nice left by Cabbage. Cabbage is doing very well. Oh, good elbow by Cabbage. Cabbage. I was a little nervous, but now another elbow lands. Oh, oh Cabbage! Okay. Nice combination. Butterbean might be hurt a little bit. Butterbean trying to work the body. Cabbage throwing everything he's got. Here comes Butterbean. Oh, wow. Oh, Cabbage, another shot to the body. Look at Butterbean, just taunting. He's just like, come on. Oh. He's he's put another tooth out. another tooth out, it looks like. Oh, oh, man, my. the crowd is electric. How, how long can this one go? I mean, you got BJ Penn screaming, Troy <laughs> screaming in the corner. Oh, nice oh. by Cabbage. Up to, hits the Butterbean in the cheek. Wow. Wow. Are you kidding me? I want to know if what there's a, a first tooth round. on the canvas. Is what there a, a tooth round. on the canvas? Great fight, and this is what Rumble on the Rock does. They bring it to you worldwide on the internet. It doesn't matter if you're in Brazil watching, China, wherever. They're using the technology Here and they're using go. it wisely. Here, Here we, we go. go. Second round, Butterbean and Cabbage. How long did this go, man? Right. Drops the hands though when, when he gets hit yep. with the legs. Good, good job with the leg kicks. That's what Cabbage should be doing. He's just sticking with those leg kicks. Butterbean wants to close the distance to try to hit him. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Man. Landed, but the, the Kevin, I mean, Butterbean doesn't even move. He just kind of says, uh, says, all right, whatever. <laughs> I mean, he hits him with less. It doesn't look like, it doesn't look like you hurt him. Look at, look at Butterbean just kind of rubbing his nose. If you're Cabbage, what are you thinking? Uh, kick. <laughs> Stick and move? I, I don't even know what to say, because if I was going to fight this fight, I, I would just take down Butterbean. I don't want yeah. to crack my one of those big... Could you, though? I mean, can you take down a 394-pound man? Somehow he'd be eating a flying knee or something. Man, no kidding, huh? Cabbage is just looking phenomenal. Oh, right hand by Butterbean. He shows you that power he's got, man. I'm surprised Butterbean's not working the body a little more. I don't know if 
you can knock out Butterbean. There's a nice jab. If he knocks out Butterbean, Cabbage is my hero. <laughs> I hope he does. Good kick again by Cabbage. That's why he said he might stick a move in this fight. He's what do you do to a 390-pound guy? Can't move him. No. I mean, he's doing the smart thing. Just continue with the leg kicks. I think that's a smart thing to do. <laughs> Cabbage, oh, good combination. Good combination by Butterbean. Oh, wow. Yeah, Hold him till you get your marbles back. Yeah, you got it. But he's doing the smart thing, Cabbage. Just moving him against the fence because he took a big time shot. Wow. I, I'm just speechless right now. I'm watching these two big men. You see just... the power he has, man. I'm telling you, both hands. Now, try to see what he wants to do here. Nice knee there by Cabbage. Good knee. Here comes another one. Oh, now he's got an arm. Oh, I thought he might try to go for some kind of submission. They're screaming elbows in the corner. Good old-fashioned slugfest here, man. I, I mean, Cabbage, you know, looks like the better as far as cardio goes. He looks pretty, you know, not winded, but, you know, gets rocked by a couple of Oh, that of was a low knee. Larry Landless telling Butterbean to keep him high because it looked like he had a low knee. Oh, good ooh. combination by Butterbean. Oh, another oh. one. Cabbage cannot continue to eat those. Butterbean's going off now. Yeah, the Cabbage is a stainer. Yeah, he is. Oh, oh. good elbow there by Cabbage. Yeah, but you don't want to stand and trade with too many of those, though. We're talking about Cabbage, No, you're guys. right. You're We're right. talking Absolutely. about Cabbage, who's been beaten by the best and only but the best. But still, though, you don't want to take those kind of shots. Oh, and Cabbage is wincing in pain. He got hit with a body shot. Cabbage is in a lot of pain now. He's just wincing. You know, I don't know if he got hit with a body shot, but, you know, prior to that, he was... Oh, look at Cabbage. Cabbage right now is just wincing in pain. I don't know if he can go. He's in a lot of pain. I don't know if it was the thigh or what. Cabbage now doubled over. Cabbage can't go. Oh, Cabbage is in trouble. Good Cabbage shot. is in a lot of trouble. Butterbean trying to finish off Cabbage Carrera. Going to the body now, working the body shots. Cabbage is not going to give up. Cabbage he, is doing everything he can to stay in The only in there. way this is going to stop is if Larry stops the fight. And Cabbage needs to take it down to the ground and buy those 15 seconds. Because, I mean, right now, he's wincing in pain. I'm not sure what it was. But, I mean, those thunderous shots will take their toll. And right now, Butterbean trying to finish this fight. Continues to work the body. Cabbage trying to land a knee. Cabbage doing anything he can to stay up. Cabbage is doing a great job. Man, I tell you what, this has been toe-to-toe -to -toe for 10 minutes. Well, approaching 10 minutes. Two... Five minute rounds, Larry Landis is gonna break him apart. Cabbage though, I mean, Cabbage does not look like he can go, but he's still gonna go. This is like Rocky. Cabbage just trying to hang in there. Get in there, Cabbage! If he can just get through this round, at least he can take a breather, but I'm telling you, man, he's just in a lot of pain. Foot oh, stop now by Cabbage. Time. Doing anything he can. Getting gangster on him. I, I, I know it's been unreal. What is going on? This is like Rocky in Russia or something, man. <laughs> right now they're just clinching. Both guys, I mean, they went such at a frantic pace. Both guys now slowing down a little bit. This has been a stand-up fight the whole time. Only went down once. And, and, and I got to give a lot of heart to Butterbean and to Cabbage. Both guys, absolutely. You Ooh, he's, got like both a, he's got like a lock or something. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know what that is, but he's got both the arms of Butterbean locked up. Oh, Ooh. a knee lands. That's a low knee. Larry said that. Okay, that's the other round. That was a low knee there. Ladies and gentlemen, after two rounds of action on the doctor's advice, the referee, John Larry Landless, has called a stop to this contest due to the doctor calling the stoppage himself. For the winner, Butterbean! I was informed that the fight was stopped because Cabbage has a broken arm. Folks, come on now, you got your money's worth. Are you kidding me? Wow, what a performance that was. Cabbage, talk about this fight first of all. Uh, I liked it, I enjoyed it a lot. Uh. <sighs> You got a broken arm, though, from this whole thing. What happened? How did you break the arm? Uh, from the elbows. Those elbows you landed in the clinch? Yeah. He's got a hard head, then. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> like a bowling ball. <laughs> oh, 
Unbelievable. What, what do you take away from this fight? Because it was an amazing fight to watch, an amazing fight to call. What, what do you take away from the fight? Nothing. Nothing at all. No regrets. What's next for you? Whatever. Rematch. A rematch. Who wants to see that? I'd love to see that. You kidding me? Wow. Butterbean, congratulations. I mean, uh, your face says it all. His arm says it all. Talk about this fight, man. Tough, tough. I mean, first time I busted my teeth out for some, for some reason. I had to clean my mouth teeth, get the chunks of teeth out, and I went back at it. How many teeth did you lose? You I'm hoping not count out too many. I saw you spit out the teeth, what, at the end of the first round there? End of the first round. And then uh, he was hitting you with those elbows. I mean, you acted like they didn't hurt. They had to hurt, though. I got a hard head. I'm from Alabama. Come on. I can hit for a living. Butterbean, what, what was it like for you to compete in Rumble on the Rock? I tell you what, you couldn't ask for better fight fans. The people here would make the fight so much fun. Would you give a Cabbage a rematch? We'd love to fight Cabbage again. Let me get some new teeth and I'm ready to go. Congratulations. How about a big hand for these two gladiators putting on an amazing show tonight. And who knows, maybe we will see a rematch.